everyone, what's up? This is Saravi. And if you're looking at my tie and you like it, well, this is one of the things we're going to talk about today. I am going to show you how to put these unwanted CDs lying around in your houses to better use. There are n number of things we can do with these CDs. Uh, but in this video, I'll be showing you around three to four things that we can do. And here we go. Alright guys, so for this first DIY, we require an old tie of yours or your brother's or your dad's. I've chosen my dad's uh, tie and uh, I have started painting it with a black poster paint. You can choose any color of your choice and also if you want to go for a full look, you can cover the whole tie with the same color. I have uh, taken a half and half look so I will just be covering half of the tie with CDs and that's why my background just covers half of the tie with black. Next now we start cutting the CDs and uh, sticking it onto the tie with the help of a glue gun and you of course can try different combinations of how you want the CD pieces to be placed on it and go for the best one. For the next tie, I chose to cover the whole tie with tiny CD pieces and that's why I am covering the whole tie with a background color as well and this time I've chosen green as my background color because well I wanted to change from black of course. I chose to cut the triangles a little small and tinier compared to the one cut in the first one. box that holds your LED lights and converting it into a beautiful holder it could hold your pens your paint brushes your makeup stuff anything but we just got to make sure that uh, you don't put something heavy in it because it's ultimately going to be of cardboard and it's going to be very light done fixing the base of the box with the help of a glue gun we will now be cutting the flaps from the other side of the box because that will be the top of our container painting the container and I've gone for a metallic bronze color and that's what I'm covering it with. You can go for any color of your choice. After you're done painting it, you can now take the CD and cut it into any shape of your choice and start placing it over the container in any pattern you'd like to.
This is our third DIY for today and here you require three full CDs and three colors of your choice and also a woolen thread because now we are going to make a container which is specifically going to hold your earrings and neck pieces. Uh, you'll have to cut a tiny piece of the wool and loop it around on the rear side of the CD and stick it with the help of the glue gun. Do this to all three CDs. Further to that, you'll have to use a container which you recently made. Insert a branch and stick it with the help of glue gun and then start inserting your CDs through the branch and stick them as well and you've gotten your holder. You can make it as pretty as possible by cutting and putting how many ever CD pieces and in whatever pattern you want to on it. And now for our last DIY for today, we will again require three full CDs, a uh, silver spray paint, or any color of your choice of course, and some puzzle pieces from the puzzle you no more use. I have uh, painted the puzzle pieces uh, golden, you can again choose any color you want to. And once you're done with that, you need to stick the three CDs together with the help of a glue gun in such a manner that they overlap each other. Start placing the puzzle pieces in any manner you'd like onto the CDs and make a pattern out of it. how your DIY has turned out so hashtag DIY with B on Instagram and I will take a look at it give it a thumbs up if you like the video and leave your suggestions in the comment sections I would love to check them out and don't forget to subscribe thanks again guys and have a nice day bye bye